Hello everybody and welcome back to Redstone Builds. Today we are doing the combination lock door. And we're going to be taking this video a little bit differently than we would normally. I usually show you it and then build it. But this one is really simple. So if we actually just reset this all. Wow, uh, brain fart. Sorry everybody. Uh, so if you want to build like an adventure map or you want to you're in a protected zone because honestly somebody could just break right through your door and you just want to build like a combination lock for your door so nobody could get in to you, all of your stuff this is a video for you I will teach you so I have it set up so my password is two three five oh lock the door get in I got my diamonds and I come out here just reset one lever and there you go and this is really simple it's not easy to break at all you actually have to I mean you can make this thing go on forever so just so you know it's uncrackable unless you know the combination or you bust it and break the combination or anything like that just looking at it it's impossible you'd have to try all the combinations. So to show you guys this, we're just gonna run around to this other side here, and bam, this is all it is. It's not very hard. It's easily condensed. You can easily condense this, guys. This is not that bad. Um, but I have it set up like this, just just so you guys can see it very easily. So I set it up so my password is two, three, and five. So if you notice, the ones that I, I want to switch, or because right now all the levers are off, they're not giving out any redstone. The ones you have to flick on, turn on, are the ones not with, they, they just have redstone to a piston. They do not have the redstone torches. The redstone torches are there for, if I flick this, it removes the redstone. So as you can see, you start off with a redstone torch and to a repeater. The repeater is important because the repeater is what sends it through the red wool. Or or just wool. Wool in general. It doesn't it doesn't have to be red. Um and so you just make a line of repeaters, having you know, the longer the combination, the longer the line of repeaters. And then at the end you have it go off to this. So if we type in our password real quick to three five you see that all of them are forward making the redstone pass through each redstone repeater to the end all the way over to the door and unlocking the door so that's how you do that and you could actually make this go down and under and have it do a double door but you know I I didn't really want want to take the time to do all that because you know it's just a simple build it's not really how to do the door it's how to combination through the combination so I mean this is a really just short and sweet episode on how to make a combination lock uh, I'm sure there's like a lot of more complex ways you know and you can get the you know big I don't know what was it nine digit combination now this is just a little simple combination for you guys that are just looking for just a really quick easy way to lock your stuff up so thanks for joining me guys on redstone builds episode three we're on we got what four videos three videos if you're not including the update including the icons if you haven't heard about that i am now doing i uh, youtube icons so go check that out is a video right before this one so I will see you guys all Monday because we are now trying to do daily videos and but I'm taking the weekends off for work so I will see you guys all Monday on our next adventure see you all later